Uh-oh. Early on set carpal tunnel. But I'm here now, so we're fine. <laughs> but yeah, no, my fingers were hurting. So I waited for that to calm down. And now we're here. It's probably gonna be like that a lot, because your boy... Uh, tis the season to have, uh, finger pains. That's all I'm gonna say, that's all she wrote. So now that my fan's going on, let's, let's, let's try and listen in and see if it's doing, it's sounding off. <laughs> no, I think it's good, I think it sounds okay, I think, I think we'll pop it, owie, I think we're okay. I don't think we're okay anymore, but I mean, we should be okay, maybe? No, my glow link! We should be okay. We're gonna hope and we're gonna pray that we're okay, but... When is hoping and or also praying ever worked? Quite a couple few times, actually. Oh, he fucking... <sighs> this just in, I forgot that my brother forgot to undo my keybinds. Next on the agenda... Would be to go the way that I found the baby zombies in last time. Let's see if God wants me dead. Oh, fuck. Fuck me, bro. I'm no longer having a good time, uh, because I just got the fuck scared out of me. Oh, hi, Mr. Creeper. Hi, yeah, I didn't see you there. I'm gonna die. I dislike this a lot. Actually, being on being in a cave lights my nerves on fire. Oh my god. Yeah, no, we're gonna go back up and we're gonna have figure out another a different project to do today. Shit. Cause frankly. I love my life. I love my life in in this world. I have three cats back home. I, I don't need this. I don't need any of this bullshit. I, I got a redstone dust. That is my accomplishments for today. You know, I feel like what I should do, because I've fallen, because I've nearly fallen, and I actually have fallen from here quite a dozen times. That's such, like, a precarious mine situation. So we got the mining shit done. Nether exit portal. That's back there. Oh, I could probably do the nether. I could probably do the, the exit portal. I'm sure I could pull something out of my ass for that. Let's see if I can pull something out of my ass for it. I was talking to my friend today. And, like, there's this one class that, I, that I've taken every single year since I started high school. Well, yeah, yeah, technically, technically, yeah, because freshman year didn't count. Freshman year did not count at all. But, uh, like, usually it's, like, a class that you can retake and retake as many times as possible as, like, you want to. And so that's what I did. And so I'm probably the most experienced in the class right now, and the reason why I say that is because, um... We have nobody who was there last year except for me returning this year. And so my friend was like, yeah, teacher said that uh, you're the only returning student. And I was like, what did you, did you like ask? He's like, no, no, teacher, teacher uh, volunteered this information. I was like, oh, knowing that you're my friend. And he was like, yeah, I was like, he fucking knew, he knew. This was a warning, a, a warning to prepare to get ready for tomorrow. I'll also, like, not be streaming, like, when I usually stream tomorrow, because, again, school, school will, will have started, and I will, uh, be the cringe fail, uh, scholar that I've been, actually, since I started streaming. Like, streaming, uh, more Greek only. Also, another reasoning as to why I wasn't, like, sorry, uh, another reasoning why I wasn't, like, doing the streamer thing for like five days was because on monday 
your boy had to fix his hearing because he just straight up could not hear at all. Like your boy's ears were clogged. He like they're like he could not you could yell at him and he could faintly hear you. But other than that, he could not hear you at all. So, yeah, I was just sitting there like, oh, fuck. And so I literally just sat there and, like, poured shit in my ears. I call it the fizzy- I call it the fizzy juice because whenever I put it in my ears, it all bubbles up because it's acid and it, like, breaks down my earwax. So, it makes my ears really itchy, though. <laughs> and usually, you're supposed to put them in for, like, 20 to 30 minutes. Uh, I put it in for like an hour and I did it's like I think there's like a warning on the box that says do not do this more More than once every day or some shit And so I did it twice in one day for both ears because I was like this is just not fucking working And then one of my ears was swelling and I was like this is just not I'm not living la vida loca I have two free periods to start out my year though Usually we're not supposed to have two free periods, but this new counselor lady, she's she's real great. She's she's real grand. She just let me she lets me have two free periods, and I was like, thanks, ma'am. She's like, yep. I'm a little bit sad though because because she's new. That means she doesn't know like my priorities as a senior. I think she'd assume that all seniors have the same priorities, or maybe I don't know. I don't know how many years she's been teaching, or like been a counselor for or some shit. But, you know, I was sitting there, I was like, because, I, I don't know, I, yeah, I, it, like, I didn't get a class that I needed, that I needed to take. It was that, it was actually that class that, um, has no returning members, <laughs> except for me. And, so, I was like, oh, shit. And I'm really glad that I ended up contacting my counselor, because I was like, ma'am, ma'am, I need this. Just like, okay, let's chill. She had a graphic design class, though, which I'm slightly miffed about. I was like, are you serious? It's like, ma'am. Ma'am, I had that in for a reason. I d she was really nice about it, though, because I was like, hey. I have 11. I, I seem to be signed up for 11 classes. And, like, I subtly let her know. I was like, hey. I was worried, which is just uh, when we speak for, hey, I'm panicking about this real fast. Help. <laughs> She was like, yeah, no, use what I see on my screen. And I was like, thanks, man. So she showed me, and I didn't have that one class. I was like, hey, I noticed that I don't have this one class, even though I signed up for it. Help, change this. And she's like, yeah. She's like, yeah, sure, I can do that. Thanks for letting me know. And I said, thank you. I'll see you in school. See you on Friday. <laughs> she did not get back to me after that, which was unfortunate. So, is now a good time to tell you that I have no, like, no want or no of, I have no idea what I want this to be. And what I'm thinking right now is, I did this, fuck, which, which SMP did I do this on? But I did this on one of the SMPs I was on. It was this thing where I, like, I had moss, but we're not going to work with moss because we don't have moss. Like, <sighs> So what I essentially did was I, like, made this little cave-looking thing, and it was in a hill. But since we don't have a hill, we're gonna work with this and act like it's a hill. We're gonna make a hill. Bring it- and bring in terraforming to a whole... Whole ass other... Other meaning, baby. Because you best believe... Your boy is not moving this entire portal one block down. Or two block down, I don't care. He'll just spit me on the same place. I got worried for a second, then I remembered that I stay strapped. I decided that I wanted to play on this day, even though I wanted to play on uh, Hypixel. Not gonna lie to you, I really wanted to play on Hypixel and do like Bed Wars or some shit today, but then I was like, no, I can't. I well, not at least not for like a little bit because I need to, I need to do hardcore because I miss my hardcore worlds. I miss the fact that I could die with with a single misstep. I'm running low on coal again, aren't I? Yes, I am. Thank- well, not thank god, it's actually quite the opposite. This is a more of a fuck moment. I now understand why I'm running out of coal. 
because of my uh, hobbies of lighting up the entire area. My cousin, uh, I know that I showed you the uh, her little world. Those torches that were around were not around before me. I was like, you should probably light up your area. You should probably light up your area. She then exploded. Uh, she got exploded by a creeper. She didn't die, though. It's like, hey, you should light up the area. That would prevent the creeper. And she was like, shit, you right. So I've been saying this for 30 minutes. Boom, boom. Strive for perfection in the Wimbro household. I need more fucking ah. That is deep slate. I don't need no deep slate. Actually, I could probably use some cobblestone too. This battle looks so fucking ugly. I'm I'm gonna applaud it. I'm gonna applaud my work. Is this is this necessary? Probably not. That's why I'm putting the corner here full of fucking. <laughs> That's why the corners are being filled with cobblestone. I know, listen, I know I just said that we do things in the Wimbrier household, even though nobody else, nobody will probably have a seat, but, like, we're not that, we're not that bougie. We're not that bougie. Can't afford that much stone. This is a fucking economy we're running. Oh, yeah, I trapped a fucking chicken. I forgot about that. This is at such an uh, such a wonky spot. You can like watch as like I pause and then I just start doing things again. Like you you you're, you're witnessing you're witnessing what I what I like to call the Wimbrio focus. It's not all that focusing and it's not all that uh, dope as fuck, but uh, gets the job done, I suppose. Oh, it's about to look like a weird fucking hell. Let's go. Let's go. It's gonna be a reason for that. What if we just do the front and not do the back? Who would ever know? We wouldn't. Nobody would ever know. Nobody would ever know. Nobody would ever know. It'd be so. It'd be so much easier if I just didn't do the back. Say as I grab my seven stacks of dirt. Was that seven stacks? Three, four, five, six. No. It was six. I almost just- I- I need a hiccup, and I need to burp, and I feel like that's gonna make me throw up. <laughs> this build was a steak of, of the miss variety. Yep. And no, we didn't name the beef miss. That'd be funny though. Have you seen the- the thing that, uh, vegans are trying to do? Well, that they're doing? That they're making the- Oh, this cow had a name, her name was Hillary or some shit, and it was like- I saw a reel where someone was like, I would find my name. And I, was just, I honestly agree, but my name is... I doubt that they'd name a cow my name. I feel like, I feel like that would incur the wrath of uh, a god. Or... No, it, I'm not named after a god. I'm named after one of the other important dudes. You think that's that's uh, vegan's next step, next big step? They're like, oh... You can't be religious, you just ate the blood of the actual body of a cow af named after Christ, and I think that would be fucked up. I think that would be the most fucked up thing I've ever uh, imagined, actually. Um, <laughs> not quite sure why I imagined it. Speaking of coping, I've I've actually been, like, writing a whole lot more, because, like, one big hobby of mine, I fucking love writing. I just write whatever I think, and it's... Like, it's so nice, but I've just been writing a bunch, like, thousands of words every night. And it's, like, coming together in a very coherent story, and I'm like, how the fuck do you do this when you're sleep-deprived? And I guarantee you it's only gonna get worse as school starts, because I'm just gonna, I'm gonna try and I'm gonna keep writing. And the moment that I fuck up, <laughs> not even fuck up, just the moment that something happens, and, like, all of my per precious little building blocks just come tumbling down all over me, is the moment I'm gonna go like fuck it and everyone's just gonna die. I'm gonna hit them. I'm not them. I'm just gonna hit myself with the most devastating like trauma ever. And be like, be like, oh yeah, by the way, this man's dead now. So let's let's moido a man. I don't care about plot. No more plot. Only pain. Only angst and sadness. And it's gonna be my Joker arc. If I officially run out of dirt, like, a block before I finish this, I might go, in, like, fucking insane. Nice, cozy little home that's a little bit funky and weird. 
It's not grown on me at all. It's actually quite the opposite. I think I've grown such a hate from working on this fucking house too long. Nice, nice little... It's not even nice, it's shit, but it's fine. I don't need to be Picasso to actually get Minecraft done. I'm i I'm goaded. I'm goaded in other ways. I live life in constant fear. That one day, I will die. Because I know I will, of course I will. What's life without a little bit of dying? Certainly not living. Certainly not.